smoke as we feel them fly 747 high I'm never choking steady smoking like that Devin guy or is it whiz player you know what it is I just rolling up with that fire and I take it to the wind now I'm high as shit high as shit and I'm rolling slow and I grab the Sprite grab the Sprite and pull up some more sipping Texas champagne blowing California dro yes your pine I'm sick oh man I got that Arizona flow all the smoke is that potent weed also burning that platinum What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, GZ509, coming at you with another video. Before we get started, you already know the deal. Hit the like, the subscribe, and that notification bell so you're notified anytime your boy, GZ, drops a new video. Shout out to the real ones. I'll pray for the fake ones. I hope everyone is having a blessed day. As you can see by the title and thumbnail, your boy, GZ, got another Funko pickup. And I usually don't do unboxings and all that stuff when I only get one Funko, but this is a Funko that I've been wanting and I've been watching and I've been waiting for. So <clears throat> real stoked about this. Um, this package is coming from Mandrill Toys and Collectibles, and I will link all their information down in the description. Um, you can follow them on IG. This is the first pickup from them. I never went through them before, but we're going to give it a try. I did get this through eBay, but... They send it in a box and it says Mandrill Toys and Collectibles. They're from Virginia. And I don't know how to pronounce that name. I guess it's Aquan, Oquan, Okokoan, Virginia. So <clears throat> let's get into it, guys. So <clears throat> let's see what your boy GZ got here, man. And just so to show you guys, you know, they did really good on the packaging. You see that? Fragile, do not drop. Pretty dope in my opinion. So I've already like them just by the packaging. So let's get into this. You got bubble wrap. And then put a card right in here. Thanks for your order. Enjoy 20, 15% uh, off your next purchase with promo code. And yeah, man, they have a, a let's see, a Facebook, a Twitter, YouTube as well. Huh, I'm about to go check them out, guys. So let's get into this box unboxing. Uh, they got bubble wrap all around it, which is cool. I really dig that. Oh, shit, they even gave me a... Nice. They gave me a protector around it. And as you can see, it's your boy, Miles Morales. Yep, this is the one I've been waiting for, guys. You know, I have... Uh, I have one more than this, and I haven't. We're going to do a, a standby on there and a comparison on this. So let me open this up. So I do want to take this guy out of the box. But they did send a, a protector, uh, whatever the hell you call it, a protected box, a clear box that goes around the actual box. So I think that's pretty cool. You know, so far, I'm digging the, uh, the packaging on these guys and how they're taking care of their uh, Funkos. So that's real cool, you know, <clears throat> you know, a lot of some companies, they don't send this. I thought that was cool. I think I ended up paying, I think it was $11.99 and then with shipping and all that stuff, I ended up paying like $19.50 with shipping and stuff, but got it open guys. I just didn't want to rip anything or anything like that. So got a lot of classic everywhere which I, I i think that's cool guys i really do they didn't want no fingerprints on this they want this to be yours you know what i mean you're gonna be the one first one putting hands on it and all that stuff so we'll take it right out of this you can see protected box i like that you know clear little box that's cool that and overall looking at it box looks flawless guys I don't see any rips, nicks, dents, any of that shit. You know, I don't even see any fingerprints on this. This must be, you know, this is me. But you guys can see right there, man. It's that boy, your boy, Miles Morales, man, wearing the hoodie. And he got the J's on. So let's get into the box. This does have uh, the PX uh, preview exclusive on it. Um, and I think this came out October 23rd. So... I seen it and uh I went to it this weekend I went to my um 
comic book shops and stuff. I know they were going to release them at any of the local uh, comic book shops or anything like that uh, in your guys' areas. Uh, unfortunately, in my area, Spokane is flawless for not getting any kind of heat. So I didn't, I wasn't able to get it. So I ended up looking on uh, uh, eBay and I picked this guy up right here because I had to get him. And let me get the little stand for him. So I'll put him on the stand. <clears throat> Set this over here. Real dope though, guys. You guys can see. We'll give him a little shot right here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Miles Morales. He got that. You know, he's wearing that. It looks like a Carhartt jacket. And then he's wearing some cargo shorts. And then he got his, his, uh, his uniform underneath. You know what I'm saying? His little gloves, you know, black and red dress, and he has the uh, the Enter the Spider Verse uh, Spider Man symbol on his chest. This is a real dope pop, in my opinion, guys. Um, just by looking at it, you know, uh, they did really good on the details. I do like this one a little bit more than the other one I had, just because he's he has his actual mask on and all that stuff. So I'm gonna put him on the stand. I could just hold him like this, guys. So. You guys can check him out. Give you a little little B roll on him. But yeah, he is very dope, man. I really dig uh that Spider-Man into the verse. I think that's one of my favorite movies um from last year. Um as you guys know, if you guys look at any of my uh other videos, um I did cop the Spider-Man ones. Um just I mean strictly I, I liked them because I wanted the Chicago's, but <laughs> I needed those shoes because, you know what I mean? I'm big into Spider-Man, especially that movie. That movie is one of my favorites. You guys should know that. But yeah, man, overall, man, you guys let me know what you guys think about him, man. Did you did you guys go after this guy or did you pass on him or did it not get in your comment? I know uh, Davey McFly, I know he hit on it. His comic book shop had him. But anyways, man, so I wanted to get this guy. So this is the other one that I have right here. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure a lot of people have this one too as well. But I wanted to do a comparison and see if they did anything different or anything new to the actual shoes. And it looks like the shoes are still the same, you know. See that? They're like the Chicago's. The only thing is, is they don't have the swoosh right there on the side, man. That's the only thing that sucks about them. But man, I got two of them. Man, I know I wanted to get another one, but this, you know, you know me, man. I'm about my J's and I'm a big Jordan head, so I had to get these one because they're wearing the J's in this one. You know, y'all let me know which one is your favorite out of the two, you know. I think I'm leaning more towards this one because he's. I remember him in this uniform in the... Uh, he just looks lit as fuck, dude. So I'm real happy to have this one in the collection. I, I'm happy to have both of them in the collection. So like I said, man, drop something down in the comments, man. Let me know if you guys pick this guy up. You know what I mean? And how do you feel about him? And how do you feel about Funkos in general? And what's your guys' next pickup? You know, uh, I don't know what my next pickup is. Um, I know I think today, <clears throat> today is uh, Halloween. So happy Halloween to everybody. Um, they dropped the uh let's see what was it the michael myers and then the other child's uh the chucky then a child i think it's child's play 2 or whatever um they dropped those at hot topic um i think that's a i think that's a pickup that i would like to get my hands on um but the one that i am looking most forward to is uh the the 10 inch uh jordan funkos you know i think that he's wearing a black jersey and he's wearing a white jersey i'm not sure if i might got the colors wrong but those ones I'm looking forward to. Um, I know there's been rumors about a Tupac Funko coming out, so uh, I'm, I'm looking forward to those. Still waiting on the Migos to drop. Uh, I went and checked that GameStop, and I think they said sometime around uh, January 15th. You know, you guys correct me if you guys hear anything else, but that's when my store is getting them inside their warehouse, so I'll, they'll be calling me around that time. So I'm looking forward to that. Uh, Let's see, what else did I see uh, this week? Oh, I seen uh, The Warriors. If you guys ever seen that movie, The Warriors, the 80s movie. Um, they <clears throat> are coming out with some Funkos too. I would like to get my hands on that. Uh, let's see, the Tombstone ones. Well, Wire, Doc Holiday. I, I definitely want to get those. 
and like that's kind of about it right now oh i think they did have an electronic uh vader i think a darth vader that i wanted to get my hands on but yeah man there's a lot of funkos coming out man it's, it's hard to try to keep up with them but i'm gonna try to do the best that i can and bring you guys more content man but anyways man i'm gonna go ahead and end this video i'll give you some b-roll on the uh miles morales man thank you guys for rocking with your boy much respect stay blessed and on to the next peace